hello friends welcome to our youtube channel so uh, in the last video i have explained about the polygonization process also so uh, with the continuation of that video here i will tell you about the polygonization steps so there are two steps in the polygonization first one is migration of sub grain boundary okay and uh, the second step is coalescence of sub grain okay so there are so these are two steps which is required for polygonization process so how it happens actually I told you also about the polygonization process that in this polygonization process there is a tilt boundary forms right and rearrangement of the, the dislocations so first uh, we'll see this process so what happens actually if suppose the dislocation are arranged like this in the different grains okay so in the collision process of that grains these uh, two kinds of uh, dislocation the arrangement of the dislocation in two grains will be like this okay so this is the polygonization process okay and now we will see these two steps so how these two steps occurs in a material so suppose there are two grains this is uh, grain 1 this is grain 2 so these two grains are uh, arranged suppose these are the orientation of these two grains okay so in this polygonization process these uh, two grains first the subgrain boundary the migration of sub and uh, subgrain boundaries so the subgrain boundaries are those which are oriented with the less than of some uh, 15 degree or we can say in between of 5 to 10 degree okay yeah actually which are they are less than of 5 to 10 degree these are the subgrain boundaries so here we will see first that all the boundaries are like in a same way first it will orient okay and then next step will be the coalescence of subgrains so that will happen like so in that one there is a collision of subgrains okay yeah and uh, in the last step it will be like uh, the complete collision of a subgrain will happen here so that will form a new uh, shape of the grain so that might be like this not uh, exactly but yes that might be like this so this is about the polygonization step migration of subgrain boundaries and the collision of the subgrains okay now we will explain here about the we will see about dynamic recovery okay So if the process of the movement of dislocation if the process of movement of dislocation into subgrain or cell boundaries takes place 
during cold working then the recovery process accompanying with it called dynamic recovery okay so this is basically thermally activated process thermally activated cross slip so the main mechanism uh, for this dynamic recovery is thermally activated cross slip okay now i have already explained the mechanism of recovery in the last video uh, but even though i would just give some brief outline about the mechanism of recovery once more so the mechanism of recovery as i told that the low temperature and high temperature the two steps are required for that one but here we can also say that there is one more step that is intermediate so the low uh, temperature in that one diffusion of point defect okay diffusion of point defect at the grain boundary or uh, uh, surface or the as a prismatic loop and the second one is combination of point defect okay that is collapse combination of point effect next is intermediate process okay in intermediate process rearrangement of dislocation rearrangement of dislocation within tangles okay and annihilation of dislocation annihilation of dislocation with the opposite signs and sub grain growth so these process also are compared with the intermediate steps and with the higher temperature dislocation climb and cross slip sub grain collisions is sub grain collisions and polygonization okay so these are the steps happens in the recovery process so mechanism of recovery happens in uh, to be very um, uh, clear or transparent the first is low second is intermediate stage and third is the high temperature so in this video up to here only so this is all about the dynamic recovery and the polygonization steps that is migration of subgrain boundary and collisions of the subgrains so kindly stay connected and uh, like share subscribe our youtube channel thank you